Hello out there YouTube. What's going on guys? It is D Dunn here, the most chill COD player. Uh, back with another Kim Strike on Call of Duty Ghost. Uh, this again is with the M27 uh, LMG silencer rapid fire. Pretty much the closest thing to OP <laughs> that this gun has or that this game has as far as a gun. So uh, we're going to talk about the gun a little bit and then we're also going to talk about uh, this gameplay a little bit because there's some stuff I just want to just want to talk about and uh, get y'all's opinion on and whatnot. So uh, but real quick before we get into that, uh, I talked to the clan leader, the clan I'm in, and uh, he said my the the Kim that I gave to them for my first upload uh, should be live, I believe he said, on the 17th. So I'll be sure to make a video then, uh, linking you guys to the channel so you guys can go check that out. Uh, in addition to that, I also got a 41 gun streak uh, last night with this exact same class setup. So uh, look forward to that. Um, I don't know when that one will be up, but uh, I'll be sure to again link you guys uh, whenever that does go up. So anyway, to this gun. Uh, this gun is it's pretty much OP. Um, I'm not going to lie to you guys. It is... By far and away the best gun in the game. Um, there, when I very first started using it, I was running a silencer and grip, and it's just like with with the grip, it literally has no recoil. I mean, literally no recoil. I'm ex not exaggerating at all. No recoil. Um, but I just feel like it kills just like insanely fast with rapid fire, and even still, there's not a whole lot of recoil to deal with. Um, the iron sights are good, uh, and it doesn't have one of the chain mags, so it reloads super quick, as you can see right there, especially with sleight of hand. And uh, I looked up the stats online for this gun, and the three-hit kill range on this thing is just monstrous. So even with a suppressor, you're still going to get three-hit kills from a very long ways away. Um, if you want to run Deadeye, I pretty much gave up on Deadeye, but if you want to run Deadeye, uh, it just, it's insane. It's Melt City. So, anyway, uh, if you guys haven't given this gun a shot, by far, it is the best gun in the game. I held over a 3KD uh, with this gun for um, oh, for for a couple weeks after using it. Um, so, yeah, give it a shot. And, anyway, on to the gameplay. So, as you've noticed right now, um, right off the start of the game, I made my way across uh, to their spawn flag, and I neutralized it. And um, that's pretty key because, um, I mean... If I were to play uh, more objective-minded, I guess you could say, I should have just gone ahead and capped it, and then maybe we would have, uh, you know, had the lead uh, to this point. But in my mind, if I neutralize it, the game's going to last longer, uh, so I'm going to get more kills. And as well, if my team uh, could have pushed and uh, capped the B flag, then, um, you know, then we would take the lead. Um, so... Yes, I could try and go and solo cap B, but another thing about this gameplay is that we are playing a uh, th three or four man party. Um, so, you know, most likely they're communicating and uh, they're all hovering on the B flag. So trying to solo cap B is going to be extremely difficult. So instead, I decided I'm going to neutralize this flag, uh, give our team uh, a chance. Because also, if I just go ahead and cap the C flag, chances are they're just going to flip to the A side and go ahead and cap that and then we're still going to be double capped. So in my mind, by neutralizing this flag, it's going to make them want to come towards it. And basically I just kind of uh, hover around this corner right here and just spawn kill them over and over again and uh, kill them while they try and cap the flag. And worked out, uh, I ended up going on a 30 gun streak, but I'm just going to cut it off uh, after the Kim strike. Uh, almost got a double actually went on, I think probably like a 15 or so. Um, but, uh, yeah, that just wasn't in the card. So anyway, uh, let me know what you guys think about the strategy. Do you guys feel like I was in the right and the wrong? Let me know. Um, look forward in a couple days to my first upload to my clan channel. And, uh, if you guys did enjoy this video, feel free to leave a like. If you hate it, then dislike it. And I'll see y'all next time.